All right, all right, all right. So I've just updated you on the Hulk. I wanted to update you on these two RCs. So I haven't just been being poncy. Although the longer I leave them on the shelf, the harder it is to run them and get them dirty. But I will do. Don't worry, I'm not going to do that. I've been waiting for some T-Bone racing upgrades. So there we have it, T-Bone at the front. And what I actually did here, which is interesting, well, interesting for me is that this is actually a Creighton, a rear, a Creighton rear uh, uh, bumper. And the reason why I did that is that the, the offering from T-Bone Racing actually normally sticks out further and has a lesser uh, of an angle. It's just a bit further out, which I, I didn't want. I wanted the bumper close to the front grille. So I went ahead and I shaped it myself to fit the front. All of this is custom work around the sides all around here, which turned out pretty good. Um, and uh, the rear is a bumper from Triple M in Germany, uh, which uh, which went on pretty sweetly. Uh, this one is supporting Deep Blue, is supporting a, uh, a T-Bone Racing rear wheelie bar, which is just infinitely better than the stock. And a T-Bone Racing um, basher or thrasher front bumper. Um, both trucks have now got um, dusty motor shrouds covering them up because when you do a custom build with a custom uh, chassis, you lose your side guards here. So it is worth it is worth getting some dusty motor covers. And deep blue, I haven't actually really introduced you guys to yet. I'll try and give you a, 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 a decent overview and then tell you what's coming up on the channel. So uh, this is a still a brand new, this has never been run. It was, it was, a, it was brand new, uh, a notorious buy. Um, it has got um, custom RC upgrades, front and rear suspension hangers, front and rear. It's got uh, Just Bash It RC uh, chassis, Just Bash It RC eight millimeter shock towers. I think they're the eights. Yeah, they're the eights. Um, it has got, these are stainless steel GPM Creighton um, uh, 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 rods and uh, with Traxxas rod ends because the GPM rod ends aren't as strong. Um, it's got a Just Bash It RC uh, top plate. It's got, where's me, um, goodness I don't even know how to get into it. So if I undo these side parts and just show you what's going on in on the interior on this. Uh, so we've got a um, uh, Just Bash It RC um, uh, servo mount and all my, I always forget all of my armor cars run a very simple, cheap, fast tracks alloy bell crank system that I buy from Model Sports. They are cheap. I've never snapped one, they're alloy. Um, they improve the steering tenfold, um, so very good buy, obviously on ball bearing, um, um, obviously running, um, uh, yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, front and rear chassis braces from, from Just Bash It RC, uh, Triple M in Germany, front and rear, uh, centre differential mounts and motor mounts. And this is the motor, interestingly, that came with my 30 degrees north one sixth scale, one seventh scale, one sixth scale um, uh, desert truck. Um, it's a 1200 kV 5887 uh, and it fits in here like it was like it was meant to. This will be an 8S truck. Um, what else can I tell you about it? I'm still running the stock uh, suspension. Uh, uh, both springs and um, uh, 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 oil, shock oil in there. I will change them out. You can see I've got the rears wound all the way down because it is slightly heavier, um, particularly with two 4S batteries in it. Um, these are the stock wheels and tyres. I'm running Just Bash It RC 10mm hub extensions and these are Just Bash It RC really nice um, uh, wheel hexes that I run on all my RCs. 
um, which is pretty cool. So that is deep blue in a nutshell. That's deep blue. It will be bashed soon, I promise. <laughs> 